Delivery and takeout was supposed to be a lifeline for restaurants during the stay at home order. More than a week in, some say they're still closing. With that, we say good Monday evening. In fact, some say it's not safe to even stay open. I'm Brad Edwards. And I'm Erica Sargent. Our Tara Molina is live in River North, where restaurant owners say they may never recover. Tara. Erica, some restaurants say they just aren't getting the business they need to stay open right now. And others, like the group that owns Pacific Standard Time behind me, they cite the safety of their staff and their patrons as a reason to, they had to close their doors. Oh, yeah, that's hot. Gail Voss is used to whipping up hundreds of farm fresh grilled cheese sandwiches a day. Today, five. With no lunch rush and the typically bustling Block 37 Pedway for weeks, those five sandwiches are behind the difficult emotional decision to clean up and close up entirely. We don't know what's going to happen. I put traffic down in the Pedway, which I need to stay open. Having already laid off her employees, she tried delivery services, but didn't get the boost she hoped for. I did sign up for uh, Grubhub delivery as well as Uber Eats delivery. Grubhub has been one to three orders a day, and um, I'm still waiting for my Uber app, uh, Uber Eats uh, tablet to arrive. She's not alone in her decision to close for the time being. Joining restaurants who were doing takeout and delivery, like Big Star, Publican, and Pacific Standard Time, now closed with one-off hospitality group closing all of their restaurant's doors. A spokesperson told us as the virus continued to grow, they had to put staff and guest safety first. It's not clear when they'll open up again. That's up in the air for Gail, too. But in all the uncertainty... I'm optimistic. The National Restaurant Association estimates that just in the first three weeks of March, the, the industry lost about $25 billion in sales and 3 million jobs. Reporting live in River North tonight, I'm Tara Molina, CBS 2 News. And right now on our website, find out who's hiring, the new way to file for unemployment online and or by phone, and where to apply for business loans. It's all on our website, cbschicago.com slash coronavirus.